What up guys? This is my uh, impromptu lighting rig in my car. Got the dome light, got my uh, windshield, what is this? Visor light. It's not a windshield. It's ridiculous. I wanted to record something because I haven't recorded anything this week and I have another one coming out this Friday because it is a Friday vlog. I just want to let you guys in on some stuff, some awesome things that are happening. Kate and I and Judah obviously are going to be moving to Franklin. So we have been living in Spring Hill, Tennessee, which is about a good 30, 35 minutes south of where I work. Uh, without traffic, it's about 20, 25. With traffic, it's about 40 to 45. On the way home, it usually takes me about 45 minutes to an hour to get home, just because the traffic gets bottlenecked so bad going south. So it's really a tough commute for me, and here's why. And I haven't told a lot of people this, but I figure it's time to talk about it, and this way people kind of understand me a little better. I have a... Uh, condition that affects uh, intestinal and bladder stuff so it's gonna be it's gonna be fun to talk about it's not disgusting it's just a nuisance basically what it means is I have to go to the bathroom way more often than normal people like imagine if you just sat down and drank like 364 ounces of coke and you have to go to the bathroom really bad now imagine that that usually happens towards the end of the movie right and you're like oh the movie's over I can go to the bathroom well I get that feeling about two minutes after I go to the bathroom. So it's it's constant. I'm constantly feeling, feeling like I have to go to the bathroom. So that's something that I've had for like the past seven years or so. It's not a terrible disease. I mean, it's not anything like life-threatening or anything like that, but it's just really annoying. And it makes it to where I can't really like do long trips in the car and I can't really ride with other people in cars and stuff like that. So. I tend to opt out of like road trip stuff. I don't like riding cars with other people and a lot of people at work have probably noticed that, that I tend to when we go like for like team outings and stuff, I will drive by myself. And that is a deliberate choice. That is just something that I do to help with the condition to keep my stress down, to keep the, just the, the flare ups down and stuff like that. So it's nothing personal. I really like you guys. I like everybody, but man, it's a hassle and it's just something that I deal with, but it affects my commute in the morning and it makes it really, really hard. So Kate and I made the decision that we were gonna look into moving into Franklin and we found an incredible place that for Franklin is super cheap um, and definitely within our, our budget. And so we just feel blessed that we get to live that close. It's only going to be a 10 minute commute to work now with no traffic whatsoever, which is fantastic. I'm really excited about that. And it's right in the middle of Franklin. So you've got all kinds of like cool things to do. You got a theater, food, you know, all kinds of restaurants, all the amenities that we would need are right there. It's got a pool that's open 365 days a year from 10 o'clock in the morning to 10 o'clock at night, which is way better than what we had before. Yeah. Our old pool was only open like three months out of the year and closed at eight o'clock at night. Like, there's still like two hours of daylight left <laughs> after that during the summer. I'm excited. I just wanted to update you guys on that and just talk about that a little bit. We're gonna be moving in the middle of November. So, if you wanna help me move, show up. I think that's all I wanted to say. Man, these things are getting shorter. I think I'm running out of things to say. I need like some topics some stuff to talk about. I don't know. Not that many people comment on my videos, but if you want to comment, comment and let me know what you want me to talk about. I'll talk about it. I will just talk the living fire out of it. I'll just talk, talk, talk. That's about it, guys. Now you know my deep, dark secrets. I will talk to you soon, and I'll see you Friday with a brand new blog, Ultron Out.